go, I had to go through the whole medical joint with the uh, NFL. So I went through that whole process and that took years to get uh, all finalized. So I went through that. But bes- besides the whole getting your body right, mentally, just understanding that life goes on in a different direction, though. So the same game plan and everything that you go through for football and stuff, you know, you, we, we are creatures of habit. So once you get your habit, you understand that, you know what I'm saying? I, I need a practice time. I need this film or whatever it may be. You just find ways to incorporate it into regular life. So with me, well, first I did some coaching back in uh, Illinois before I moved out to AZ. But then just moving out here, um, still going through some concussion and all this other stuff. But with the kids, it's easy for me. I mean, y- y'all got kids. I think kids make it a lot easier. It, it, for me, it makes life make more sense because nothing they do makes sense, but they perfect <laughs> in the way that they are. You know what I'm saying? You you see them do shit and you're like, bro, what the fuck are you doing? But then you're like, oh, I'm supposed to teach you that thing. So you got to just take it for what it is. You know what I mean? So they make it a lot easier in that respect. You know, you still go through your your individual battles that depending on how you were brought up and whatever you're going through in your life. but my kids and my girl make it so much easier because shit, I know I'm I'm out there. So they normal, which is all over the place, brings my chaos back back in line. Now you mentioned going through kind of the whole medical stuff with the NFL, not to get in your business or to go into too many details, but a lot of people don't know what any of that means. So what's it like when you, because we always talk about how physical and how brutal our game is. Uh, when you walk away, what's that like going through that process and figuring out like, hey, am I good? Do I need this? Do I need that? Uh, it, it's actually, it's pretty weird. So like, I mean, I played, I played in New York. I played New England defense, special teams, but I didn't play as much as y'all play. I ain't about to sound like that. So you would think like, man, he ain't do as much as he ain't bang around like I banged around. You got me fucked. Well, nah, that ain't true. So I go start going through the medical stuff. And, you know, at first you just go and see about the different benefits. They got line of duty stuff, you know, just to get your body checked out. So the things that I think are normal, you know, my back hurt a little bit, my shoulder, my knee, you know, just regular stuff. And then you start going to get x-rays and MRIs and they like, nah, bro, that ain't, your, your neck ain't supposed to be like that. Your shoulder ain't supposed to be like that. You know what I'm saying? So, shit, all that, but what I think is regular, ended up being a whole bunch of stuff, you know what I'm saying, I had to deal with. So, flying is different now with the new CBA, but shit, I had to fly. Man, I was in California, I was in D.C., uh, Florida. They had me flying all over the place to see different doctors just to get MRIs over here so he can tell me I'm fucked up. And then, but I'm kind of good. I'm fucked up, but I'm kind of good. So he just sent me to the next doctor to tell me I'm fucked up, but I'm kind of good. And they just send you all around. So I did that for, like I said, it was probably about, I don't know, longer time, damn near two years. Mm. 